Check out my business website too. Today, let's examine the surprising differences between three Excel file types in the context of their use in Power Automate. So, let's create these files. First, I'll create a folder to put them in. The first one is the XLSB file. Now, in SharePoint we cannot change the file type. Let's open the file in Excel Desktop. Currently the file is called xlsb.xlsx. The only way to change it to an xlsb file is to use the save as command within Excel. Back in SharePoint let's create the Excel SM file. We, again, have to use Excel Desktop to do this. In Power Automate I created a flow that uses an Excel action. Here, you can see the Excel SM file is not visible to Power Automate. However the Excel SB file is. Both are VBA macro files. Formatted tables are visible in Power Automate for Excel SB and Excel SX files. Office Scripts runs in all three of these Excel file types. So, in this case Office Scripts wins hands down. Have a nice day. Check out my business website too.